want you to. In here. Oh hi. I want the the Give med me the kit. Briefcase. Hold on. Save and continue. Yep. No, save. One second, Jackal. I have to. I have to get. I can't get out. Okay, yeah, there we go. They're all here. Good. We'll need them. The APR in the front is still coming after the civilians. Probably think they can kill them or drag them back over the border. The only ones who die today are the ones who are coming. I planted some dynamite out there by that overhang on the cliff. But the deck cord's no good, so one of us has to go up there and short circuit the blasting caps. That car battery will do the job. The debris will block the road, keep the soldiers from following the refugees. And it'll kill the poor bastard that takes the job. That's either you or me. The other guy's gonna take those diamonds to the border and use them to bribe the guards, so there's no problems with the crossing. Those civilians are making it to the camps tonight, every last raggedy one of them. Then when the handoff's complete, that guy, you or me, is gonna put a bullet into his own head. I do both jobs myself, but there's not enough time. The only way this is gonna work is if we see it the whole way through to the end. Every cell of this cancer has to be destroyed. That includes you and me. If we don't finish this, then the whole mission has been a waste of farce. It'll start up again, just like it always does. So which one do you take it? Diamonds or dynamite? It's up to you. <sighs> wow. I'll take the dynamite. Good, you know where to go. I'll be dead in an hour and so will you. Africa wins again. Hold on, let me save again so I don't have to go for that dialogue in case I die, which is probably going to happen. Yep, saved. Alright. And this seems to be the beginning of the end for our lovely neighborhood friend, Joseph. He was a great man, a wise man. He's not dead yet, but I am getting his speech prepared. He started life here, relatively simple. He was, he was in a cab doing nothing of importance really and then he met the jackal. The jackal tried to kill him and apparently gave him malaria. I wasn't really following the story back then and I still don't am not true to this moment. Actually I kind of am. I'm gonna go kill some people and they're gonna go kill me. Try well attempt to, but they're not they're all gonna fail. Why did I just blink that? Um wait, what the hell? You know, I'm gonna go talk to him again, see if he's still there and then he's gonna be like, okay this is what I want you to do, go do this. It'd be nice if I should if I started picking no I can't go in there. Okay. Okay, so maybe oh this way maybe maybe and then it'll just head around on top of it. Okay, you know what? I'm gonna go this way just in case. I think this is the way to go. See, it looks like it's going up, so maybe it just um, goes around. Oh, yep, that this has to be the way because there are people who are still alive. <laughs> if I if I was already here, they would all be dead, or I'd be dead. Someone would be dead if I was already here. Okay. Oh, would you, no, no. Get back down. Yeah, that's more like it. Here, yeah, what have you got there? Ooh, don't mind if I do. Okay, just run. Just run. Just ignore them. Just ignore them. They're a figment of your imagination. A figment of your imagination that happens to have guns that shoot bullets at you and that really, really, really hurt. But you're with it, man. We can do it. Okay, come on. Oh, no, no, no. You stop that. Thank you very much. See? All it takes to get your way is a whole lot of bullets. Unless, of course, that they happen to die. In which case, it's not going to happen. What? No. No. Not going to happen. See? He he tried to get his way using my method of technique. Or method of technique? No. He tried to get it his way with my method or technique, or whatever you want to call it, which is killing people and putting bullets into them. But it didn't work because he didn't use the right amount. Uh, but anyway, I think this is the right place where we have to go, so, yep, just a little further. I should probably put away the gun, but, you know, it looks kind of cool, so it might intimidate. Oh, there it is. And this is the end. Goodbye. For Africa.
That is the end of Far Cry 2. Thank you for sticking around for this. If you watched every episode, or if you just watched one episode, if this is the only episode you've watched, then thank you very much for watching this. If you like Far Cry 2, you are awesome, and you deserve a fist bump. Like, if I, if I was right next to you, I'd, and you said, man, I enjoy Far Cry 2, I'd give you a fist bump. I'd be like, hell yeah, and then I'd probably high-five you, and you'd, you'd probably give me a weird look, and you'd be like, ah. I don't try quite trust you, kind of creeping me out. But that happens to me a lot, so I'm used to it. But anyway, I'll let you listen to the credits, and I'll, I'll join you back, I'll join you again towards the end. Okay, see you in a moment.
Hey, how you? D I'm not asking you out. Um, hi. Although if you do want to go out, I'll just you know my number. You don't know my number. Uh, hi. Yes. Uh, so this is the ending of Far Cry 2, and I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for sticking around to the very end of this Far Cry 2 Let's Play. And yes, I am padding it out. But anyway, thank you very much for sticking around. I do hope you enjoy it. And please come back when we enter into the world of Far Cry 3. Soon. Trademark. And this is the main menu. Well, I guess there's only one thing left to do. See ya.